you will note, um, Sandra Bland is wearing the same clothing that was has been depicted in the dash cam video. The infamous mugshot is taken against the wall, where people have gone to great lengths to try to insinuate or imply that she's deceased. Five. 545. Okay, so there she goes into the holding cell. Now, the charges are read to the defendant. Uh, rights are explained. I believe the defendant is asked whether or not they may or may not be able to afford an attorney. The reason we're doing this is because of the misinformation that has been put out both through social media and even through mainstream media that has led to uh, the rumors that Sandra Bland was in some way deceased or harmed or not uh, well when she was brought into the Waller County Jail. Because of some of the things that's gone out on so social media, um, this county has been literally attacked. Uh, we are under cyber attack by individuals uh, like the group called Anonymous who has claimed that Sandra Bland is deceased in the mugshot. You will see, see video here today that will show that she was alive and well when her mugshot was taken. So we're hoping that by providing this video that will dispel a lot of these rumors and mistruths that's been perpetuated. And I hope people will understand that when it comes to correct information, social media cannot be relied upon. It is important that we release this information because we have received death threats against Waller County officials. We have received threats against our facilities. Um, and this is based on this notion that Sandra Bland uh, was deceased, you know, and, and dead before she was even brought into the Waller County Jail.